me the truth? And if my own sisters can't be honest with me, then who can? How many boyfriends would I have to lose before I learn the reason? They're just trying to spare me from all that pain. Besides, once I'm done and sculpted, I'll get any boy I want. Well, I really don't think that boys, I mean, it's not... Look! I'm sorry. I'm just in a testing mood because I have had so much to do and all these pudging activities and I didn't get to eat dinner tonight. Didn't get to? Well, I'm in the B group and we only eat dinner on even number nights. So, yesterday, tomorrow, and then Sunday. Well, what did you have for breakfast and lunch? Water, celery, and lettuce. I'm detoxifying my body. Well, it doesn't sound like just that. Look, they're just trying to help me with life the way that you help people with papers. Well, I'm here to help you critique and improve your paper. I'm trying to give you skills that will last a lifetime. But it sounds like they're just they doing this a long time. All of the sisters are very successful. Some of them are even engaged before they finish college. And are they happy? Are they happy? They're beautiful. They're getting married. How can they not be? Well, I really think that, I mean, it just seems like that's a lot of pressure. Look, you want to know? What do I want to know? You want, you want to know because you never have or never will have this kind of an experience. What do I want to know? You want to know, so fine. I'll tell you. Even though you didn't help me with my paper, and even though I'm starving and tired and sworn to secrecy, I'll tell you so that you can do tonight. What will you tell me? They line us up. They strip us down. We can wear our underwear if we want to, but not the really fast. Because for them, the sisters need to see everything. And then they mark us. They mark you? They mark us, and they prepare to sculpt us. They show us where we're fat, where our boyfriends will be repulsed, where we'll lose job interviews, where our friends will be grossed out at pool parties. They mark you? Is that so hard to believe that they would show us where the world will hurt us later? I just, I really think that, I mean, this is just, are they writing on you? Don't look at me like that. How can you be so happy? You would be in the naked fat group. You want to see? You really want to see? Do you want to see what it would be like to be a future success? I, does that see what I think it says? I, but you don't have to.
right. Because people are suffering, because we need to educate each other, because for so many reasons that I don't even know it. <coughs> In 1987, the concentrated studies on Bolivia Nervosa had only recently begun. Anorexia Nervosa has been studied beginning in the 1990s and continuing into the present to observe a substantial increase in incidence. However, at this time, there are no officially reported prevalence and incidence studies on Bolivia Nervosa for the general population. And epidemiological surveys do indicate some eye catching statistics. So, Mom hasn't been doing well lately. I want my mommy back. The stupid eating disorder is swallowing her up, and I feel like I've lost a part of my best friend. It's weird. It's like she's physically there, but she's really not. Contrary to popular belief, every person who isn't believing does not have to vomit after binge eating. By definition, a binge is an uncontrolled intake of a large amount of food followed by regular, compensatory behavior to affect overall body shape and weight. This behavior is not limited to vomiting, but can entail laxative misuse and excessive exercise. She is the strongest person I know, and I know she's going to get through it, but the thing is, when? How much more suffering does she have to go through before it all ends? I'm scared. I'm scared for her. I'm scared for my dad. I'm scared for my sisters. Please, God, help her defeat the monster that's consuming her. Please help my family get through the tough times. I hate not going all the time. Depending on the current definition of the major nervosa, 26 to 79% of women and 41 to 60% of men have reported binge eating. When the definition was curtailed to associations of binge eating with isolation, depression, self induced vomiting, or laxative abuse at least once a week, 1 to 5% of women and less than 1% of men identify themselves as bulimic. These numbers may make bulimia to appear to be less common, but the general population is as many of the bulimia symptoms. It is a matter of meeting all the required criteria to be medically classified and diagnosed. I hate not seeing it all. I haven't seen mom genuinely happy in a very long time. I miss her. I miss her jokes, her perfume, her laughs, her hugs, her presence. It's really great because like I have things in here like I have a poem from Veronica, um, 